Um, years ago, uh, I was in Washington, and uh, it was a miserable early spring, about this time of year, except it was miserable. And, and, it, and so, uh, golly, I hate talking. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> it's worse that you have to listen to me do it. Um, but I... I I was in the city waiting for a subway ride or whatever it was, and uh, there was this parking lot full of these commuter bicycles out in the elements, chained to their spots, waiting for their owners, you know, to come back out at the end of the workday to reclaim them and ride them home. Uh, one bike uh, caught my eye just because uh, it had obviously been abandoned. It was uh, out there, rusting, heap of metal, seat was gone, the tires were gone, missing, stolen, whatever, and... Um, and, and so uh, I just felt sorry for this Schwinn, and um, I just wondered, you know, I started imagining its story, if it could tell its story. Um, you know, I imagined sort of this uh, thread running through its uh, life, you know, dealing with abandonment and loneliness and wondering uh, where its owner went and why that person left them there and abandoned them but never bothered to ever come back and to reclaim them. Uh, and, and, you know, it's like, why, why me? What happened? What did I do wrong? That kind of stuff. And, uh, and so, you know, I left and, but was haunted by this Schwinn, this inanimate object, and sort of projected myself at some point into that, into that bike's predicament. And saw, I saw something in that bike uh, the, of myself. And um, just the, the, the moments I think we have, perhaps, of, uh, at least I have them, um, just the moments of feeling abandoned perhaps by God himself and just uh, those times where it's uh, painfully dark and painfully quiet when we want answers and there are none. Uh, and just kind of, I think it just uh, thinking through those questions and, and all the myriad doubts and all that, the raging heart stuff that goes on, just uh, made me realize that one of, my, I think, my deepest desires is the, this... Uh, desire to be found, you know, to be reclaimed, uh, perhaps one day, hopefully one day, and, uh, you know, made new again, so to speak. So um, as far-fetched as this may be, this is a song I wrote from the perspective of that bicycle. So this is called Chrome, and I hope you enjoy it a little bit, or a lot. So. Capital disgrace, wheels of rusted spokes, and a heap of metal waste. I used to weave a legend through a ten speed world of fame. Commute through miles of traffic, wait through wind and snow and rain. But then one day it happened, my rider never returned. Chained to times revolving on my history, never learn. Cause I want chrome for my heart, chrome for my skin. Chrome becomes a part of me, like God inside of men. I want chrome. I want chrome. strong and hearty soul I've been to far off places but I did not forget my home except for long lost beauty and weary flattened tires time is overtaken what chrome once made me shine chrome for my heart chrome for my skin chrome becomes a part of me like god inside of men i want chrome for tomorrow chrome for today chrome the rust can't prey upon and will not fade away oh i want chrome Sunday. 
Skin, pray, oh 